Balance and strength workout. Follow along. Stand straight. Raise your hands. Going as far as you can down and up for a nice stretch. Ten circles. Gently keep our balance as we go down and do a few hand movements. Lift one leg. Rotate gently. The longer you can hold your balance, the better. Stretch. And switch. We're going to hold our balance. A gentle hand stretch. And chest. Gently get up. Lift the other leg. Hold it up as long as you can. Dancer pose. Lift one leg and the hands are in praying position for an extra balancing support. All fours, lift one hand and leg to the opposite and hold it for a nice balance training and strengthening effect. The other side. This is a gentle workout. Same exercise with the leg going up and down. Few times and switch. Hold your legs slightly up. Don't need to go very high. This is a flowing side stretch and balance. Gently lift one leg, flex your toes. Extend one arm and reach out with the other arm. Hold your balance. Keep the other standing leg soft in its knee. Continue. Excellent. We're going to a plank. We're going to do a couple of push-ups. As far as you can. And go ahead and stretch. Get ready. Hold the balance. Lunge back low. Once you reach the bottom, you may touch the floor. Go ahead and enjoy a stretch. Switch side. Again, the other leg, standing leg, strong. It's a balance before a lunge. And a side stretch.
Go ahead and bend your knees. Knees are not passing the toes. Gently lift one leg at a time. Again, it's a nice balancing workout. So lift them without moving the shape and then straighten each leg. You may do a turn out and point. Now go ahead and stretch. We're going to keep that balance because we need to stay longer on that leg. Stretch it as far as you can. Open your hip. And keep going with the leg. As long as you need to. Just stay there. Even if you do all these exercises a little bit, maybe you fall today very often, that's okay. The more you try it, the stronger balance you're gonna get more muscles you can engage. And if you're not exactly with me today, I'm sure you're gonna get it very soon. We're going to squat down with a straight back. You may place your hands on your waist for extra support. Go ahead and hold it. Stretch. Sit on a chair or a sofa. Lift one leg and same arm. I'm doing a little bit of a churn out. Great. Switching sides. Leg extended. Excellent. Lean back. Abs workout. And in, out. Keep it strong. Lift one leg, lift your body. And do gentle push-ups. We're working our triceps. Go only as high as you can today. Try to have a little turnout. This exercise is not just a leg lift. We also are doing turn out and turn in with the foot, the hip. We start a little bit moving it forward. And when you're ready, move forward all the way. As high as you can, and an extra hip stretch. I'm gonna get back to all four and switch sides. Up, turn, in. Bring the leg forward and back as far as you can. A few times. Stretch your hip. And back. Let's go ahead and find a spot where you can hold your hands and feet on the ground. We're going to do a small lift and a large lift. This is a great workout for your flexibility, strength. Now go ahead and just either hug your knees or sit there for a bit to balance back and switch sides. Lift, full lift, half lift, and full lift.
Again, after this, just take your time and sit for a moment before getting in. Stretch your hip. Stay there. And get ready to switch. A stretch. Hold the wall if you need to. Breathe. Sit very slowly into a nice stretch. When you're ready, bring your hands to praying position. Everything is slow to allow you for a time to balance and strengthen those muscles. All right, let's lift our legs slightly back diagonally and we're going to strengthen it. We're going to flex and point your toes and the other side. Flex and point your toes. Lift, bend leg with the standing leg being slightly bent as well for a slightly altered effect. Bring your knee forward, hold your balance, engage your muscles, the core, and turn as many times as you can hold your balance. We're going to switch sides, bend both legs slightly, hold it, and when you're ready, we're going to bring it forward, keep it there, and rotate. Great. Lift one leg, flex your toes, and try to grab them. You may need to bend your standing leg, knee at first. Hold it as long as you can. Great. Slowly lower it down. Extend your arms. You're going to flex your toes and hold your leg with slight pulses up and down. Switch the leg up and down. Gentle pulse. Bend your knees, keep your back straight. These are very slow marches front and back without straightening your knees. Keep them bent for an extra balance support. Lift, lift, back, and up. Great. Grab your Straighten the arm with the other hand and feel a nice deep stretch. And switch. This is a floor workout. We're just doing a backwards push-ups. Straighten your legs as low as you can. 
alternate. Excellent. Calf workout. Squats, knees to the sides. Toes are pointing the same direction as knees. This is a flowing stretch. Remember to flip your palms. We're going to go as far as you can. And switch. Warrior pose. Moving with the head. Straighten both legs. And the other side. Down and up. Stretch. Your supporting hand can be on your thigh, knee, or on the floor. Remember to enjoy it and look up. Breathe. Switch sides. Breathe. That's our last exercise. Well done. The more you do it, the stronger balance you will have and the more muscles you will be able to engage to support yourself. Well done. Coming to you from beautiful Ontario. Thanks so much for working out with me.